on making an app to end doom scrolling and hopefully destroy TikTok scrolling addictions. Today is day 129, and we're just going to be talking about why I am not giving up. Specifically, why it's actually easier not to give up in my scenario, and for many people's scenarios that may be related to yours, uh, it's easier not to give up than it is to give up. Uh, this is because, in the end, it's just going to be better than doing anything else. Um, if, and this is a big if, if you are going where you want to go. So me specifically, I want to help people. It's a big thing. And I think having a purpose is also a big thing. A purpose to help people, a purpose to help people with the problem that is increasing every day, which is doom scrolling. So it would be much harder for me to give up at some point along this line uh, in the end. So if I'm going to look back in 30 years with anxiety because I know I could have done better, and then it's going to be easier to just keep going now. Yes, it's struggle. Yes, it's pain. Yes, it is growth because that's what those things are. But if I want nicer things or juicier fruits to come or to live any better than I'm living currently, um, then I need to do better. I need to be better. I need to maintain that version of doing my best and not giving up. So truthfully, um, if I'm doing my best, I'm sorry about that, every single day to make this app better, to help people stop scrolling so much, I think we can get very far, especially over a longer time horizon. Right now, it's month five, day 129. I'm going to be doing this for quite some time. You may see we're on year five, month five in the future. I don't know. Uh, we'll have to figure out as it comes. Dynamics change, problems change, and we're going to try to help people. That's the goal here. And we're going to try to end doom scrolling. Today, I have not worked on the app yet. I just bought a MacBook because I realized, hey, I need a Mac if I want to develop for iOS. Um, doing it on Windows, I've done it. I have a review going right now for the App Store. It should be out within the next week. That's the hope. Could be out today, but, uh, you know, problems come up. Now, I bought a Mac because I want to develop for iOS and Android and developing for iOS on a Windows computer. It just, it's stinky. So, I had to buy a Mac to end doom scrolling. I think, what does Dano say? Sacrifices must be made for the greater good. Yeah, um, so that's what we're doing. I'm going from Windows to Mac. I'm trying to end doom scrolling. Uh, and now how I'm doing that, if you don't already know, is through curiosity. So my idea is that if someone's interested in something, they are more likely to learn about it. That's really the only way they're going to learn about it and enjoy learning is if they are curious or interested in the thing. So what my app does is it presents you with a bunch of options of things you can be interested in. You add the ones you like to your list, and then you generate a plan. It's nine steps of actionable things you can do today to get started on that thing, to take action, not just read about it all day long, but actually go out and try things. So the idea there is then to build self-confidence. And once someone has self-confidence that they can do these things, they'll do more things. They'll dive deeper to their own curiosities. And eventually they won't even remember that they had a scrolling problem because they're doing this thing. And it's so much more enticing to do this fun, interested thing they want than it is to scroll on social media, open social media, uh, and do really nothing because the progress of making progress feels really good. So that's the idea. That's what we're doing. I'm going to develop on Mac. So I'm gonna have to, I bought a Mac. It's coming uh, next week. And yeah, I mean, I think things are going up. Things are going better. I really appreciate anyone's support that they have brought to me here so far. It means a lot. And uh, yeah, I think it's going to be at this point easier to keep going than it is to give up. Because in the end, um, I want to look back at these times and even though they're kind of hard their struggle yesterday i spent like four hours trying to learn uh to allow uploading photo permissions but it's worth it i think it's fun it's worth it there's a purpose and it's actually easier to keep going and struggle than it is to give up because i don't want to look back later and realize i could have made something great had i only kept going so instead i'm just going to keep going and see what happens yeah, that's the mission. That's the statement for today. This is day 129, month five. You're built to create cool shit. You're built to be a curious human who does things they're actually interested in and goes and lives and builds the life they actually want to live. So remember that. Have a great day. I have two books linked down in the description. One is about consumption control if you want it. It's a pre-order, but it's live and you can help me make it a better book if you want. And otherwise, Curiosity Quench is linked down there. If it's on the App Store, it'll be on our website linked. By R, I mean just me because I broke it on money to hire people yet, but we're getting there, hopefully.
Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Peace. Enjoy your day. Love yourself. Encourage others. And yeah, have a great day. Get off this YouTube app now and uh, go do something if you want to. Okay, if you want, it's up to you. You're free.